Hello again. This is Priscilla Batzel, and that's a 12 by 16 by 2 inch gallery wrap canvas that I have pre primed with some mead and black paint mixed with Australian, excuse me, mixed with regular flow draw and GAC 800. I am a prism pour primary element toting affiliate of Color Art, and this is Chantilly Lace, a prism pour. And I want to do some diagonal stuff. So I'm thinking about just putting in some diagonal lines and adding some colors to them. And I'm not sure what I'm doing at all to tell you the truth. Or even why I'm joining them. But I have some silver cell activator and that's part of my plan. But I think I need more paint. So I'm just going to put colors in I like. I have some pink diamond I need to use up. Which is somewhat plugged. So I'm going to just pour it right straight out. like it's going to be the, the main color. Then I've got Bling It, a primary element. And I'm just going to use whatever strikes my fancy right at the moment. I've got some orange peel with uh, shimmer, gold shimmer in there. And that's a primary element also, if I didn't say so. I've got some Twilight Orchid, which I, I suspect is probably not coming out very well. Agave Blue. And some of the Plum Blossom. Agave Blue is a prism pour. Plum Blossom is a frosted sorbet primary element. I'm not hating those colors. I'm trying to figure out if I can add some orange or some yellow without causing myself distress. This is um, Sour Lemon with some Orange Crush in it. And I guess I'm going to try it. It's a little risky. I'm going to use some Orange Crush. I'm trying to be random, which is not my forte. I'm not very good at being random. I tend to want to make patterns. What have I got that I love that I haven't used? Um, I haven't used any Egyptian Blue in a while. And I might be in danger of making some green, but... I don't hate green <laughs> and that's very dark so maybe that was a mistake but at the moment there really are no mistakes I am going to throw some Mayan gold in there maybe twice maybe more In spite of the fact that I'm about to use some silver cell activator. I'm being called back to that Egyptian blue. If 
but I've got some indigo violet, which might be an even better choice. I make sure it's open, it'll be helpful. So those are getting to be colors that I really like the look of. And I'm thinking to myself, actually I'm thinking out loud to you. <laughs> so I've got Sparkling Aqua or Sea Monster or more Agave Blue. Kind of seems like the right choice. Wait, do I have another blue? Yes, I do. I have a Prism Pour, excuse me, a primary element that I made up called Blue Flame. Yeah, that's the one. I want something hotter as far as pink goes. And I'm very nervous about using the Miami Magenta, but I think it might be the right color. I've also got some passion. Miami Magenta is a prism pour. Yep, this is the one. This is the, the piece that this should be used in. So anything else I happen to want or need, I will deal with after I deal with these. Oh, and there's the mystique I wanted to put in there. That's the primary element I was looking for. Now it's time to try my silver cell activator in whatever way I can... Uh, I'm not sure how I'm going to do this. Well, maybe I'm just going to grab a card. And I'm not sure I have enough of that, so I'm going to use a smaller card. That makes sense. And throw a little black in there, maybe. I don't think that was enough paint. Since my canvas is painted black, I'm going to move the paint that was extra right off. So, all bets are off. I'm not seeing <laughs> that I have enough paint. And I'm going to go and do whatever comes to mind, including that's not marooned, but I do have marooned. So let's just do black and white. White first, black after, and maybe something else. Maybe something like this um, Atelier Light Turquoise. Oh, I had some really cool small cells there. And I'll just, uh, I'll forget about the diagonal and I'll make something that's more creative, let's call it. I like the turquoise. It didn't, I don't see it, but I like the cell configuration, so. Black, white, and turquoise it is. I could change my palette knife too. Just always happy when I make it to the edge. I'll go white black again. I want some of that silver to work. And I'm going to change my end. grab a much smaller card. Some of that silver and the Atelier light turquoise and some black. my 
straw. Throw a spiral in there. I like blowing spirals as much as I like putting spirals in any other way. I'm not sure how this is going to go. I w I've been looking for something that's more organic than, uh, than a keyhole swipe. It's going to be a sort of a keyhole swipe. I am going to switch gears and use some Pevio Iridescent Blue Violet. And I'm really thinking as long as I use enough of something, I can get away with it. And I like the idea of adding a few tendrils to the paint that's left on the card. Any residuals I have go right in there. So one more stroke might do it and I'm thinking that that's going to be it. And this time I'm going to give myself some of my Pebio Iridescent Precious Gold and some of the Blue Violet Precious, excuse me, <laughs> Iridescent some of the white. It's Amsterdam white and Amsterdam black in Aussie Floetrol combination. I am changing my mind. I want some more. <laughs> I want some of the light turquoise from Atelier too. Where's my little card? Pick up a little bit of paint. I'm liking this. It doesn't go down over the edge, but that's just... <sighs> Whatever you are, you need to mm, go away, but not where you just landed in my painting. It may dry in there. I'm kind of loving this. going to take anything and everything. I can find right over my edge. Pop that bubble if it'll pop. I could spin it out, but I don't think I really need to, and I really like what I have. I love you guys. I have over 2,700 videos. I think I've got 2,800 by now. And uh, if you need a link, I have them all saved by topic and genre and by the hundred. See a little bit of canvas there. I like the gaps. And I'm pretty happy with all of that. Probably could have left whatever's hanging over the side, but I think I want to use it. And I know
know that I can take a sponge and wipe off the end of my canvas if I want to because that paint's not on there so solidly yet. Better kept it, catch it in time. I think I got one little spot to catch up on. All right, let's shimmer this at you. I'm loving all my different areas, areas of cells. I'm loving my colors. It's fabulous. Look at those cells. Wow, that's gorgeous. This is fantastic. I'm so happy I did this. I'm so happy you were here. You guys inspire the heck out of me. <laughs> Plain and simple. I think I need at least one spiral, even if it's really subtle. And then there's the, but that one looks like a place for a spiral too. And so does that. Oh, that is a spiral already all by itself. All right, I love you guys. I want you to take care of each other, take care of yourselves. I'll be looking for any bubbles like that and poking them with a skewer. Otherwise, this is fantastic. Total rainbow, even though there's no Fandango. There could have been. I could have put green in there for sure. I love you guys. <laughs> Thank you for your kind words and your comments and your donations. Your comments keep my morale boosted. Your donations help keep me painting. I'm loving all of the areas the different color combinations of cells and the different sizes. So get yourself some different colored cell activators. And I like the Atelier as well as the Pebio for making cell activators out of. They work very, very nicely for me. And I'm sure they'll work for you too. And you don't need to do three quarters flow troll. You can do 50-50 if you want so you have more control with a heavier dose. Please like my videos by giving me a thumbs up, share them, and watch them longer if you have a chance. My email address is EASPB and the word gallery spelled out at gmail.com. My paint pouring recipe is underneath the video. I do sell my artwork. If you use my email address, you can inquire about lessons at the house or the purchase price of paintings or pretty much anything you want. My community board is another place to speak with me and find tomorrow's video. I post at 2.15 Eastern Standard Time p.m. 2.15 p.m. Eastern Standard Time on my link tree underneath the color art 20% off coupon code along with the color art link you will find Pinterest, Instagram, Twitter links, my Facebook group, Expressionist Fluid Art Studio Appreciation Group, um, Society6, Le Gallerist, all kinds of great places to look for things for Christmas. My Amazon link is a great place to shop at no other cost to you and my two books are there because I can and Unlimited Possibilities. They are the first and the second 100 videos I made for YouTube. I'm totally enamored of this. I love, love, love this. I hope you guys come again. I hope to see you anon. I think I said that already. If I didn't, I am now. Bye for now. Whatever I forgot, you'll see in another video. Priscilla out. There might be another couple spirals in there. You can never tell. <laughs> well, you pretty much have a good idea if you know me at all. I love you guys. I'll see you. Bye for now. Priscilla out.